A 30-year-old man is feared dead after he went for a swim at Yanchep Lagoon and vanished. Simone Luca joins us from the spot where he was last seen. Simone, what can you tell us? Well, Lou, the 30-year-old swimmer was here at Yanchep Lagoon swimming at about 6 o'clock last night when he got swept out to sea due to a strong current. His family and friends who were on the beach called police when they could no longer see him. A search was commenced about 20 minutes later but was called off shortly after. The search resumed again this morning. The police chopper scours the coastline between Yancheb and Two Rocks. At first light, water police volunteer marine rescue two surf life-saving jet skis. Divers and land police joined in the search. We're hopeful that uh, maybe he may even walk onto uh, to the beach at some stage. Family and friends of the 30-year-old man watched on from a cliff nearby. The Yanchep local was swimming out to this marker when he was pulled out to sea by a strong undercurrent. His friend last spotted him about 200 metres up the coast. Police are searching up to one nautical mile offshore and as far north as two rocks. And that has included uh, water police, divers from water police as well, uh, jet skis again from the Surf Life Saving Society uh, and uh, the Volunteer Marine Rescue Group from Two Rocks. The Yanchep Lagoon is a popular swimming spot but Surf Life Saving WA says the calm waters can fool swimmers as underneath the reef is a well-known strong current. A 20-year-old abalone fisherman was swept out to sea at this exact location in November last year. A great white shark was spotted in two rocks this morning, adding to fears the swimmer could have been taken by a shark. It's a possibility, but something that uh, we're obviously remaining, um, remaining positive and uh, continuing the search. The search was suspended about 2 o'clock this afternoon. And Simone, considering the scale of today's search, will it resume again tomorrow? Yes, Lou, a full-scale search is set to begin at 6 o'clock in the morning. While police, police say they are trying to stay positive, it's looking more like a recovery mission than a search and rescue. Lou?